Houston, you've already had a hand in creating destiny. Well, hot damn! Kelly Rowland's introducing Beyonce, who introduced Kamala Harris at her Houston rally. But don't know, maybe for this one they should have gone the other way around. Kelly Rowland might have upstaged Beyonce. She did upstage Beyonce. And Beyonce was great. Imagine our daughters growing up, seeing what's possible with no ceilings, no limitations. It's time to sing a new song. But Kelly was like a like a southern preacher up on that stage. She got fired up. She was talking about taking back the pen of history. We are grabbing back the pen from those who are trying to write an American story that would deny the right for women to make our own decisions about our bodies. Houston, we are grabbing back the pen. Yeah, Kelly, 2032. Sorry, Tim, but your day will come. She did not upstage Beyonce. Beyonce's was everywhere online. Because Beyonce is Beyonce. Kelly was amazing. This is sort of like Dream Girls, where... Let's move on, because Michelle Obama appeared at Kamala's rally in Kalamazoo, which is fun to say. And hey, every endorsement, every appearance helps if you're running for the big chair. Don't you think it was a huge miss for her to turn down Joe Rogan? Yeah. This idea that there are voters out to change their minds is silly. We are now in the get voters to the polls, and that is not on Joe Rogan. So get out there and vote, everyone, and thanks, Beyonce and Kelly. It was, um... It was a rousing rally. A rousing? <laughs> it was a rousing. <laughs> yeah, that's two words. A rousing rally. It can be both. 